Hey everybody, I want to introduce you to a good friend of mine that uh, I've just met through fishing. Uh, avid fisherman, uh, showing me some of the coolest pictures of sturgeon and green sturgeon uh, from his times fishing in California. Glenn's kind of come down here, you know, to, to try and do something that he's always kind of wanted to do. And this is actually what we do. Um, but I think he's kind of got a cool story to it. So I'll just let Glenn explain why he's fishing with us and how it went. Yeah. So, unfortunately, in January of 2022, I was diagnosed with stage four cancer. Ugh. Yeah. And uh, I got a bucket list, right? So I got on the internet and I looked for the best reviews and, uh, you know, Spare no expense, I wanted to go with the guys that get it done, right? All the reviews talk about it, and it's the truth. You guys get it done. I wanted to get a, a Marlin. It was on my bucket list, so you got it done for me. Well, Praise the Lord. Well, <laughs> exactly. The, uh, what, what kind of makes this, you know, different is because there's always pressure when we go fishing, right? There's always like, sure. I, I tell everybody and everyone's tired of hearing it, but I like saying it anyway. Like I'm actually in the great memory business. It just happens to be in the fishing industry. Yeah. Like everyone thinks like that's all, I, you know, we are fishermen, but we'll, we're more than that. We're like, we're stewards to people's like good memories and like their values when they're on the water with us. And so like for us, it, it means a lot because we like that extra pressure. Like there's that pressure that you always want to perform as a fisherman. If you don't catch fish, you're like, you're just a, you know, a guy out there, you know, taking people on boat rides. Yeah. Like, and Gilligan's Island, while a great show, you know, doesn't deserve to keep having those kind of reruns. Yeah. It really doesn't. Just saying, hey, Marianne, let it go. But, you know, like when we get that little bit of extra pressure in it, you know, we're already impassioned by what we do. But when I like, I talk to Juan, I talk to Renee, I talked to Chewy Para, that was the crew, yes. you know, that you had on this boat. Like everyone pushed their chips to the center of the table and said, let's do it. Yes. Let, it doesn't matter if we stay out a little bit later. It doesn't matter if we burn a little bit of extra diesel. Well, some people that bothers the, the burning of diesel, uh, it does bother me too. But, <laughs> you know, like, no, like what's more important? Seven bucks a gallon or like Glenn's bucket list. Yeah. So that, that's what we did. Yeah, and you did a great job of it. You and your team. Dude, I mean, I'm coming back. Right, you on. already know. Yeah, hold on. Doc, always, always pay attention. I like looking at water anyway. I just, I, as a little kid, I have this, hor I, I realized that there's fish in water. So if I look in water, it didn't matter if it's a mud puddle. Like I look at I that mud puddle and I'm like, where's the fish? And I'm like always looking for fish. Yeah. And so like every time I walk this dock, I'm always like looking in. I'm one, I'm looking for bait fish. I'm looking for anything, but now I'm like, I'm really paying attention to where Poncho is so I don't get bit again. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, uh, yeah. we digress. Uh, you got a good striped marlin. Yes, I did. The, Thanks the, to the, you guys. The, the, Lord, the Lord's going to keep you here a little bit longer, and, and we're going we're gonna to try for a blue or a black. And we're going to awesome. do it in a couple months when the water temperature is a little bit higher and we have a better chance of success. But we're going we're gonna to go on an expedition. And uh, I hope you wear the same hat because that's an expedition hat. <laughs> this is just a ball hat. That's an expedition hat. <laughs> Ernest Hemingway himself would be proud of a hat like that. And we're Thank we're you. gonna go Thank get you. that Hemingway moment. All right, uh, uh, dude. I'm looking forward to it. Uh, and I have utmost confidence and, in you and your crew. And you're the one that called yourself old earlier, but you're not that old. So <laughs> it'll just be a great Hemingway moment, not just the title of a book. All right, right brother. On, right on. I appreciate you God taking the time you, to talk brother. with us, and I'm excited about you guys coming back. And, Thank you. Thank and you. And it's so gonna much. be fun fishing. And I get to go. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. So I'm really looking forward to it. <laughs> All right, brother. Thanks again, Toby. Oh, at finger guns.